Hello, everybody. We are on chapter three, lesson four for math. And today's focus is counting, writing, and recognizing the numbers 16 and 17. So again, we are working on 16 and 17. We're going to work together nice and slow. As these numbers get bigger, they get harder. So we're going to take our time and focus on doing it the right way. Quality over quantity. That's how it works. We're going to count to 16. Count with me, please. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. How many did we count? 16, exactly. So now, after we've counted them, we have to write the number 16. 16 looks like a 1 and a 6. Can you tell me what a 16 looks like? A 1 and a 6. Exactly. Very good. Please turn your page one turn. And you should see these basketballs at the top. What they want us to do is count all the basketballs and write the number. Let's find out how many basketballs there are. Count with me. And you can cross them off too. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Our ten frame is full, so there's ten. Eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. How many basketballs did we count? One hundred? No. 17? No. 16, which is a 1 and a 6. So you're going to write it 1, 2, 3 times. Please write your 16, which is a 1 and a 6. 16 is a 1 and a 6. Good job. Let's go down to number two, right where you see the apple. Hmm. I think we're going to learn a new number this time. We are done with 16 up here. Let's count how many soccer balls there are. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10. Again, our 10 frame is full, so there's 10. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. How many soccer balls did we go? 17. Is that the same as 16? No way. 17 is one more than 16. A 17. Looks like a one, and you guessed it, seven. 17 is a one and a seven. A one and a seven makes 17. Very good. Our last one that we're gonna do together today is going to count baseballs. And baseballs are my favorite sport, or baseball is my favorite sport. I coach baseball for junior high and high school. I umpire, so I just love number three. And let's see how good we can do it. I noticed something different about this one. Oh, no. There's nothing to trace at the bottom. So we're just going to have to do it all on our own. I know you can do it.
Let's count together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten frame is full. There's ten. Eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. So how many baseballs did we count? Sixteen? No. No. We counted seventeen. So can you tell me what a seventeen looks like? A one and a seven. Thank you for helping me. Seventeen is a one and a seven. I want you to tell me if I'm going to write this number the right way. Here is this. Is that 17? It's not. What number is that? Ah, it's 16. That's okay. We made a mistake. Let's just fix it. Instead of a 1 and a 6, it should be a 1 and a 7 for 17. So we counted 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. We're right. Let's draw another 17. Okay, so we practiced 16 and 17. Now do the rest on your own the best you can. Okay, take your time and quality over quantity. Good luck, guys. Work hard. Bye.